Google Webmaster Tools Manual Actions Hello and welcome back again. In this quick video session we're going to talk about manual actions in Google Webmaster Tools. Now if you unfortunately get a message from Google saying um, they've taken manual action against your website first of all don't panic because I see this a lot obviously you know if I see a manual action taken by Google then that's a problem right and it is natural to panic and start contacting Google saying you know what I shouldn't get a manual action because I've done nothing wrong all this stuff remember Google is not out there to hurt particular um, websites or individuals okay manual actions that Google has as um, included in webmaster tools it is all automated okay so that means Google's algorithms work things out and, for, and because it's efficient um, it can work out many different things and then send you that dreadful message now manual action works in two different ways in a sense one is an action taken against your entire website or action taken against part of your website either either one is not right and we need to remedy it okay so surely you can read more about it remember Google has webmaster guidelines it is perhaps common sense and it's nothing hard to to actually adhere to okay but nonetheless you may have worked with some SEO spammers or you may have read some information which told you to go ahead and do some <laughs> techniques which was against Google guidelines. Now if that's the case then you may get that manual actions um, message, right? So I'm going to talk about the one I believe seems to be common which is the unnatural links. The rest of the manual actions they are rather easy to, to fix as in image image mismatch hidden text I see this sometimes the yeah, reason being some templates or pre-made um, content management systems at times have hidden text because of design limitations and so on right and you may not be aware of those hidden text right now if that's the case well Google can actually work that out and then send you the the message for manual actions right hacked site well your site shouldn't be hacked and spam surely you don't have spam on your website okay so with unnatural links that seems to be common now what do you do if you get a message saying you know what Google's worked out that you've got unnatural links pointing to your website once again don't panic second of all Google webmaster tools has a feature for links to your site. I also have videos on Rank SEO Services YouTube channel whereby I show you how to analyze backlinks and so on. Okay, so looking at your backlinks, writing everything down. Okay, if you worked with an SEO spammer who's bought backlinks for you, which obviously is unnatural and it's against Google guidelines, then common sense you contact the person who's got those backlinks for you and tell him or her to remove them ASAP okay now if you you know your links are pointing to your website from all different places and you can't contact um, the SEO spammer right then the next step then would be for you to try to contact the website owner okay and remember always keep a record of your interactions whether you email them keep a copy of that you know approach them politely and kindly saying you know what please um, remove this particular link and I would appreciate it and so on okay a bit of common sense and courtesy goes a long way and you will be more successful as far as getting a website owner to remove those unnatural links okay now once you follow this approach and try to get those unnatural links removed and if the website owner then does not remove these links then after two three interactions and you have those records of those interactions 
and you've done all that you can okay then you can submit a reconsideration request telling Google you know what I've got the message for unnatural links I've tried my best to remove them here's my interactions record of those interactions but it seems that the website owner is not willing so therefore I want you to reconsider that it is not my doing and I cannot really help it as far as those links being online right so Google is really fair and they will always do the right thing as long as you make effort okay so at times some backlinks pointing to your website uh, maybe from websites where they have no contact information for the webmaster right so then you can do a bit of research and type in who is plus the domain name to get an idea as to who registered that domain right and then contact them through that option because most of the records will have an option for you to contact the, the domain owner okay you can also contact the, the hosting provider okay and keeping the record for all these interactions will definitely help you when you submit a reconsideration request to Google to remove those manual actions okay so that's what I would suggest that you do and once again don't panic do all the right things and before long you will um, you know remove that manual action taken against your website I thank you very much for learning with me and subscribing to rank your SEO services YouTube channel because I will be adding more useful videos for website owners like me and you thank you very much talk to you in the next video session